perform an activity on solution. Take a teaspoon of salt. Any substances added to a liquid are called solute. Here, salt is the solute. Take a jar of water. Any liquid that dissolves the solute is called the solvent. Here, water is the solvent. A mixture of solute and solvent is called solution. Take a spoonful of sugar and add it to a glass of water. Stir the mixture properly. You will see that sugar crystal disappear after some time. This is because the sugar is soluble in water. Any substances added to a liquid are called the solute. Any liquid that dissolves a solute is called the solvent. A mixture of solute and solvent is called solution. A solution is made by dissolving a solute in a solvent. Form another activity on soluble and insoluble substances. Take a glass with water. Add two tablets into the water. You can see that the tablet slowly dissolves in water. Substances that dissolve in water are called soluble substances. Take a beaker with water. Add a teaspoon of sugar into the water. Stir the mixture properly. You will see that the sugar crystal disappears after some time. Substances that dissolve in water are called soluble substances. Take a beaker with water. Add a teaspoon of cooking oil into the beaker. Stir the mixture properly. What do you see? The oil does not get mixed with water. The substances that do not dissolve in water are called insoluble substances. Here, oil is insoluble substance. You can try this experiment with other insoluble substances like chalk powder, sand, etc. Let's perform another activity with floatable and sinkable objects. Take a glass of water. Put some ice cubes into the water. What do you see? Does the ice cube float or sink in water? The ice cube floats on water because the density of the object is lower than the density of water. I have taken a container with water and I have placed a metal ball and a plastic ball. The metal ball sinks in water because its density is higher than the density of water. 
whereas the plastic ball floats on water because the density of the plastic ball is lower than the density of water. I have taken a beaker with water and I placed a wooden block inside the water. The wooden block sinks in the water because the density of the wooden block is higher than the density of water. I have taken few things to perform the activity on floatable and sinkable objects. I have taken piece of paper, a cotton pad, wooden spoon, plastic container, nails, etc. I have taken a container with water. I'm going to place the things into this container to find out if it will float or sink. Objects made of iron sink in water because their density is higher than the density of water. Objects made of plastic and wood float on water because the density of these objects is lower than the density of water.